electronics challenge is an opportunity for the, our electronics technicians to integrate their mechanical skills, their electrical skills and their electronic skills and they integrate all those together to create a robot. That robot is then used to test how successful they have been in that integration. The robot has to follow a line autonomously and it has to uh, simulate the uh, shifting of a nuclear weapon. So the 2019 Electronics Challenge is going to bring the ETs from every state that have qualified through the Regional Challenge. I think it's an important event to host each year because what it provides is uh, for us as ETs as a community an ability and a time to actually put our grey matter to where it's actually needed most to provide solutions to the problems that we don't normally get every day of our sea life. Yeah, I've learned quite a bit of new stuff. It's more putting into practice what I've learned here at Cerberus. It's good for networking, so you do meet people from all over Australia, and Navy being Navy, you, you could be sent anywhere at any time. So just meeting people like that, it allows you to exactly that network and create friends and, and uh, people in different places from different experiences. I think probably the most thing I've learned is simple might be better. Uh, we had a few complications with some of the things that we did that were a bit complex than usual. It might not have been a necessary thing to do, but it worked well for us in the end. Be prepared for anything. Test everything that you do and test it again. We had a problem where we tested something and then on the day it didn't do exactly what it was meant to do. So yeah, keep it simple and test, test, test. I would absolutely recommend the challenge. It's a really good uh, experience for you as a technician. Uh, really good to work in a good team of people and really fun experience all around.